they came from Rome. You might be surprised to learn that Rottweilers actually came from Rome. As many people think that they came exclusively from Germany, the truth is, Romans who were at the time beginning to inhabit Germany brought the dogs with them. They had them trained to do several things, not the least of which included pulling heavy carts and doing other works on their farms. They are popular. Rottweilers were one of the most popular breed of dogs in existence. During the 1990s, they were one of the most sought-after breeds in the United States. In fact, full-blooded Rottweilers that were registered were numbered at more than 100,000 in the U.S. alone. Unfortunately, their numbers would soon decrease due to issues related to breeders that were far less than reputable. They are intelligent. Rottweilers are easily one of the most intelligent dog breeds out there. They have a capacity to understand commands and even think things through that surprises a lot of people. Like most intelligent dogs, they get bored easily and if they not receiving enough exercise and mental stimulation, they can't even become destructive because they don't have anything better to do. Therefore, it's important that you spend time with your Rottweiler. Take them on walks, play with them. This will make both of you and it will give you a chance to strengthen your bond at the same time. They are dedicated and loyal. Rottweilers have a tendency to develop close bonds with the people in their family and they make great family dogs. They are good with kids and in most cases, they become very protective of their family. As such, they can sometimes become territorial because in their mind, they are protecting the people they are closest to. Again, this is where proper socialization comes in. As long as a dog has been properly trained, there usually isn't a problem with aggression. Their undercoat is waterproof. Rottweilers have two coats. They have the outer coat, which is the hair that you see, and they have an undercoat which is waterproof. Wow. This allows them to get wet without the water actually reaching their skin. They are not fearful animals. Some dogs are naturally more excitable than others. Some breeds are well known for being somewhat neurotic and under certain circumstances. Many of these dogs can become so fearful that, is, that it impairs their ability to live a happy life. Rottweilers do not fall into this category. Typically, they are almost without fear by nature. Instead, they are usually very curious and they want to explore every aspect of the world around them, no matter what it is. They are obedient. There was a time during the history of the Rottweiler when they were actually considered to be one of the most obedient dogs that ever existed. As such, they were used in obedience contests and they usually did extremely well. When the dog has been bred responsibly and they has been properly trained and socialized. The Rottweiler is truly one of the most well-balanced and obedient dogs that you'll ever run across. The truth is, they have to be obedient because of their sheer size and strength. They are strong. These were not the dogs that merely went to sniff things out. They were there to protect their handlers and take down criminals. As such, this is easily one of the strongest breeds in existence. They're usually fairly large dogs as well. In fact, they typically rival the size of German Shepherd and in many cases. Rottweilers are physically stronger than Shepherds or many other dogs that out there. They make great police dogs. They've actually served in police forces around the world for over a century. When World War I hit, 
Rottweiler served with Germany police officers, becoming the fourth dog breed to be officially recognized as a police dog. They usually live about 11 years. As you can see, getting a Rottweiler is a big commitment. 11 years is an average lifespan for dogs of this size and if you're going to have a dog for a decade or more. You need to make sure that the animal or dog is a good fit for you and your family. Any dog is a commitment and it's important to make them a part of your family as opposed to treating them like a piece of property. Thank you for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. And don't forget to click the notification bell for more video updates. See you in the next video.